Hey guys, I'm doing a little bit of a get ready with me using drugstore products. So some of the stuff is new, some of the stuff is old. And I'm gonna, I'm gonna probably be a little bit checking of it at the end of the day or when I get done work. See how well some of the stuff pull up for the day. It'll be interesting. I'll say about night. It'll be about ninety-five percent drugstore, minus minus what? I want to say ninety-eight percent drugstore. One thing is not drugstore. I realize I don't have is setting spray. Then I also don't got eye primer, but we don't have eye primer. I can substitute that with concealer. So, yeah, so I'm gonna start the eyes. When I'm filming this, it's like at 5 o'clock in the morning. So I am going in with the new, well it's like, it's not, I haven't, I haven't, I got play this the other day, I'm like, oh my god, it's actually turned out really good, and I, better than I hoped, but what a wow, freaking packaging, it is literally not the easiest to get into. You need to find something to it open there so 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 sorry I'm gonna go with my art takeout brush and the uh, um this color right here like I played this the other day I couldn't get over how pigmented it was Oh my god, this I used to brush like this already. Oh my god, I had red on it. Oh, I don't want red in it. better than one of the lighter color or a different brush that did not have red on it. Like these little palettes, they got quite a bit of kickback, but kickback because my one of my favorite palettes do have a lot of kickbacks so I'm like I'm good with that. And then I'm going in with the, that brownish reddish color. It has like a red undertone in it.
I've been into like fall colors lately. And I'm now using that red edge burgundy red, but it like doesn't come off the color it is. Which I'm fine with. I find I have a hard time getting like wet and wild stuff out here. Like wet and wild is like hard to find and it's wet and wild and it's cheap and like it's wet and wild. Why is hard why is wet and wild so hard to find? Like literally I literally don't understand. I'm gonna go in, go into the eyes, clean up my under eye area here real quickly. <laughs> then go with the elf putty primer. Then I'm going to go with my Memorial Fallibles. I was going to go into the trees, but I might get the point of like scraping it. So.
I just want a Maybelline Age Rewind and Neutralizer. Yeah, this color comes off way too light on me, not for sure. Okay, I'm gonna put it up. Because I'm not using any liquid blushes in mine, no. I'm still waiting for my stuff to come in the mail from Shopper Summer. No way I have it by now. I have ordered stuff, other stuff, and it came faster. And it normally takes for really slow. City Bronzer by Maybelline. This is actually a really good bronzer. I'm really enjoying the bronzer again. Definitely need it after using that L'Oreal. Then that makes me look fair. I need a better color on that one. And then I'm gonna go hop in the Physicians Formula All Star Palette. We used a blush in here from Happy Growth, the Happy Booster Glow Mood Black Boost, the Happy Booster Glow Mood Boosting Blush. Oh my goodness! Even though like Canada's drugstore pricing is ridiculous. This is actually reasonable. I will give this one a reasonable price saving for it. But my goodness. It's like the issues with drugstore and Canada pricing. It's like, do I go to Sephora or do I just go to Shoppers? And Shoppers pricing is a little more expensive than on some things. And then I'm probably gonna use the highlight in here again too today too. I'm probably gonna go over it with that one. I love this like this when I pull this palette part when I do pull this palette, grab it. Like I love it. Because it has like a full face in it. They got bronzers, two highlighters, or face, and then a good blush. Like I don't know, like what I like doing is actually mixing the two highlights together. There's definitely a little bit of fragrance in this palette, but this just formula is always a little bit gonna be a little bit for us that doesn't bug me. I still like it in my skincare. So hey 
guys, so I'm back from work. So I didn't get a chance to get it on camera because my camera battery died. But I was testing out the Revlon So Fierce Mascara. This, and then I was doing some other new things. So testing out. I really enjoyed this um, gloss from Maybelline. It's nice and glossy, and it's not, not too bad. Hmm. Things more on. Ooh. Yeah, I got in what? The shade Reef. The Wet n Wild. Color Icon palette. Wow, she worn really good all day. It faded out all, no nothing. I got the shade 10 palette and it's called Heart and Soul. Really enjoyed it. It's very powdery though. I was like, it's like a very powdery, but I don't have issues with powdery shadows. So, because as long as powdery, I don't mind the matte shades being powdery, but as long as it blends. There's a little bit of kickback to it though. So, yeah. So, as for the mascara, it's not too bad. It's okay. I don't really recommend it. So like it's still there but like I like the fuller look of the my mascara because not like I'm not too like kind of not too clumpy but like like right in the middle of like make it look like this is like more like natural looking ish it makes it look like you're wearing a mascara but you're not wearing mascara I think the reason why I say that because I didn't do nothing too much too active at work today I would nearly never step foot in the freezer. Unless the fact it was the fact that um it was raining cats and dogs this morning. But I had hood I could get it right like when I feel like I could feel like my mascara ran away a little bit, but meh. It's okay. I try butter on my, my L'Oreal put I'm like, why is gonna go back to my L'Oreal Lash like my L'Oreal Lash Paradise? It's my favorite one so far. So yeah. Can't think of anything else. So yeah, so. This is then that I set my face with this, but not classified this. Like, like I said, it's like 95%-ish, ish, 98% drugstore. Everything else, one item. It's not, so yeah. I can't think of anything else at this given moment. Pulling my bag. But I can really like this gloss though. So yeah, um yeah. I post new videos every Wednesday and Friday at 10 a.m. PC. Don't forget to subscribe, don't forget to ring bell. And I'll see you